And of course, are you looking for some amaze? Get it? Maze like maize and blue? I said that for Ted. Uh, oh. Snacks for the weekend. You need to check out the Alamo City's first ever corn bar. Yes. Jesus Arriaga, owner of Elotitos Corn Bar, is here to show us how they're taking corn in a cup to exciting new places. Where are they going? <laughs> well, um, we're excited because we were able to showcase 11 different flavors to the city. And I think people aren't really familiar with that. So we love to expose new people to the, the flavors. Corn in a cup is just that perfect side, no matter what you, I mean, it's just, it's so good. Everybody fights over it, you grab a spoon, stick it in there. Why a corn bar though? Oh, well, because there's exactly 14 places around our shop right now. And a lot of them uh, are very similar in, in their corn. So I feel like people love corn. We love corn here in San Antonio. So why not give people choices and just be, make, you know, have fun with it and just, you know, add exactly what you like on there. Okay, so when, so when they walk in, you know, how does it work? What, what do they, they get the cup and you kind of give them hints and? Well, we have a menu and okay. they can choose from the 11 flavors okay. or they can go to build the corn uh, round. Okay. And they have the, the ingredients, they have the list of toppings, of dressings, and then they can add exactly what they want or they can choose something that we already have. Okay. And even though I was just told how to do this before we went on the air, I was gonna dig in the corn first, mm. but no, no, no. I, I like his Put style, watch, listen down. to this. Yes. So, <laughs> So what we're gonna do, we're gonna add a little bit of nacho cheese. And nacho okay. cheese is because people in San Antonio love cheese. Oh. Yes. And we all love cheese. So we're gonna add a little bit of nacho cheese. Here. And then, I'll, there you I'll go. I'll cheese you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. And then we have our Mexican crema. A lot of people wanna know what's the difference between crema and sour cream. Mm -hmm. The crema is a little bit less sour and it's more traditional in Mexico to have, you can put this on, on flautas or tacos. Uh, there you go. And, which and that one one's a chipotle crema right there. So okay. people also have that option as well. And why put the cheese and the crema in the bottom? Well, because when you get to the bottom, you don't want to just have water or corn water or just corn. You want to be able to have the flavor throughout the entire cup. Okay. Kind of like sometimes when you go to the movies and they only put butter on top of the yes. corn and then you get down to the bottom, it's dry. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. Like yes. That's the same process. So now you're going to add a little bit of queso fresco. Okay. No, no corn yet. There you go. You can add as much as you want. Oh, all okay. right. One more spoonful. Glad you okay. That. And then you're going to add uh, your choice of uh, either Valentina or maybe even uh, the chili powder right there in the center. Ooh. That looks so interesting. that's a little bit spicy. It's a, one. Oh, yeah. Okay. And then that's the chili so just powder. Just a little bit? Just a little bit if you like, yeah. Oh, I love that came out how. Fast. I mean, we haven't even touched the corn yet. This is quite no. a process. I love it. So now you get to add your corn. You can add as much as you want. And a lot of people don't like the corn water. I like a little bit of it in there just to kind of make it a little, a little soupy. soupy? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Because that's the thing is, this is something that's popular year round, yes. right? Uh -huh. Not just in the winter, but still in the summer. Yes, summer uh, is where people kind of crave the agua fresca. They crave the, you know, all the, those tropical flavors. But then the corn, really, you crave it in the in the winter whenever it's cold. You know. Now, do we do everything we did on the bottom? Exactly. On the top? Yeah. Okay. So you get to go as heavy as you want, Ooh. or you can go as light as you want because you already put some at the bottom. Yes. So it's up to you at this point. Once more, once once more cheese. A little more. A little of this. more corn. Okay. okay. Yeah. A little more corn. There we okay. Go. And cheese. you guys are expanding, right? We are. We're excited uh, that we are actually joining uh, the Government Hill area. We're going to be right next to some really good neighbors. We have Alegrija Bakery next door and also Fort Clordes Coffee Shop next door. So um, it's going to be a really good time being closer to the Pearl and being able to cater to those people on that side of town. Okay. Mm. And there's a big difference, of course, in the flavor between white corn and yellow Yes, corn, a lot right? of people don't know that we actually do have white corn. White corn is what you see mostly in Mexico. That's, that's what you get most over there. Mm -hmm. And then here in the States, we see more yellow corn. So we do have both of them available. Uh, and some people even like to mix uh, the white and the yellow to kind of get a, a mixture of both. That would be Mike, because I, he, I he love can that. never pick just one. Well, but then you real quickly, food. real well, quickly before we go, dig down in and get all the good. There, there. Okay. okay, you've got agua frescas. Uh -huh. I have a blackberry lemonade, and then I have a piña colada lemonade, and people love to mix those half and sure. half as well. Okay. Oh, oh yeah, I definitely want half. You're doing and a half, half and a half. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's like almost like an Arnold Palmer, but with Agua Ooh. Fresca Lemonade. Okay, and Are where's you? your location? You said you're gonna open up a new one. Where's the uh, the current location? So current one is gonna be in the Deco District on Fredericksburg Road, 1933 Fredericksburg Road, right next to the Woolon Theater. Ooh, and then the new one's gonna be in, um, like I Ooh. said, on Grayson and New Braunfels Street. Take a little bit of something and spike that up too. Oh, no, that's good, yeah. good, okay. <laughs> well, don't forget, you can get 10% off. We've got a deal for you at Elotitos Corn Bar this weekend. When you mentioned you saw them right here on SA Live, that's 10% off. For more information, head to our website, salive.com, and click on the As Seen on SA Live tab.